All right, here we have another division problem, polynomials. So again, we are dividing by something other than a monomial. So we could do long division on this if we wanted to, but let's practice with the synthetic division. Now, do you notice here in this numerator that we are actually missing one of our terms? We've got an x cubed. Normally, x squared would come next, but we don't have one. So we do need to put in a zero placeholder for that x squared. So now we'd have 3, 2, 1, none. So that's in perfect descending order. Now, we needed to do that before we started with our synthetic division, otherwise we'd miss a place. So we're going to write in our coefficients here, which would be 1, 0, negative 19, and negative 15. Now remember, in the little upside down house top is where our C value goes. So if this is in the form of x minus our C value, then that means that C has to be 5. So that's what's going to go in my house top here. And now we're going to start in with our, with our synthetic division. So we're going to drop our first term, which would be 1. We multiply diagonally. 5 times 1 would be 5. And then we combine up and down. 0 and 5 would be 5. Oh, that's not very pretty. 5. Now we multiply diagonally which would be 25, and we combine up and down. Ni negative 19 and 25 would be uh, 6. And then we multiply diagonally, which is 30, and then we combine up and down. So that would be a 15. Now remember, this last one here is my remainder position. So since we started here with an x cubed uh, polynomial, we're going to always end up with one less power. So our final answer here looks like x squared, and then a positive 5x, and then a positive 6, and we have a remainder of 15. Our remainder has to be written as 15 over the x minus 5, or our divisor. So this is how we would use synthetic division in order to, f to work that problem out. Now, um, you know, some of the other things that we've done previously, uh, we did a problem earlier where we had, we were dividing by uh, something like x squared minus, um, I think it was x squared minus 2, something like that. Um, in fact, I have it here. It's x cubed plus uh, Five, or minus, so sorry, it was minus 5x squared minus 2x plus 10. We did this problem with long division. Uh, this problem has to be done with long division because it is not in the proper form to be able to do synthetic. The only time you can do synthetic division is if your, your um, denominator here is in the form of x minus some value. Now that value could be a positive or a negative, that's okay. But here we have, this is in the form of x squared minus some number. So that's not the proper form, so we cannot use synthetic division on this problem. We would have no choice but to use long division.